So I'll tell you how the sauce takes a few hours, doesn't it? You know what I could do before you come? I could just do the tomatoes and the pot and tell them, no, you got to do it. Yeah, okay, all right. <laughs> okay. Yeah, all right. Yeah, all right. I'll, 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 yeah, no, because I want to see the whole thing. So I'll, I'll try to get there, you know. Do you no. want to get <laughs> I'll, have to, uh, I'll have to talk to my producers. I'll talk to my producers and see if there's any money. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, I know. <laughs> all right, all right. So I'll have it in the okay? Yeah, I mean, if you, yeah, that's fine. We can do that. Yeah, that works. Okay. I'll have to trade it on it. The best part of it, when it's all finished, you make your pasta, you put the meatballs out, you put the sausage out, and you put the sauce on the pasta, and you sit there and you put a little cheese on it, and that's it. That's the best part of it. Now, I'm just going to leave this here until I get the tomatoes ready, okay? Mm-hmm. I'm going to put some olive oil in here. Some olive oil, and as soon as I'm ready, I'm going to saute this and then pour the tomatoes in. Where do you go? They're going to Home Depot. Hey, Pat, I need one more can because they're not big cans. One more can? What do you one more can of, I think there's a two de rosa or something. They're downstairs. Okay. Yeah. Not that, um, Let me go down the I'll get it. I'll get it. What is it, you need Tudorosa? There's one, one Tudorosa, I think, down there. Not the, don't get the uh, Luigi Vitale. Anyone except Luigi. So if, if you if you uh, remember anything, um, you know what were your what were your parents like, and where did they come from? My parents came from Italy. One came from Foggia, and one came from Abruzzia in Italy. They were both very young when they came. My mother was about fifteen. Oh wow! I don't know about my father, but they uh, my mother had brothers living here. Two brothers, Michael and Sam. My father had no one living here, just him. His parents, his mother and sister were still in Italy. You know, when did you guys meet and, and, and what was that like? I knew Grandpa a long while. His grandmother and grandfather lived next door to us. So I knew him. I was in a wedding with him when we were like 15 or 16 years old. And then I didn't, I didn't see him for a while. I was with somebody else and whatnot. And I was engaged. I broke my engagement. And uh, we were at, I think it was Aunt Liz's wedding. And his father was there. And I just happened to say, how's Pat doing? So he said something that he was going to be coming home. So I said, well, when he comes home, let him give me a call. And he did. And that was in October, April. We start seeing each other, and we got married in October. And when he said when he was coming home, that was from... He was in the service. service, yeah. right? Uh, what, what, he was in the, the Navy? Navy. Right, okay. Yeah, I, I can remember if it was the Navy. Um, 
So uh, he proposed to me at the cherry blossoms in Washington D.C. That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Um, it's true. When when did you guys kind of like decide to get married, and did you kind of like know right right away? Well, you know, I have to go back a little bit. I had gone out with him previously. I can't recall how how long ago, how when it was, but he had taken me to a very nice place. A day, um, oh, I, I don't he would know. Um, oh, God. If you can't remember. It's okay. it, it was just a real nice place. Pat, where did you take me? Remember when we saw each other before we got together and after Lizzie's wedding? That place oh, you took. Governor's Island. Oh, yeah, he took me to Governor's Island. Island. I yeah. That yeah. Time, so I had been with him once before. You know, I'd gone out once before with him. Um, but no, I, I, he just called up when he came home from the service. We start dating. We went to Washington, D.C., and he asked me, would you get married? Would you like to marry me? And I said, yes. And we got married in October. Did you kind of have a feeling that you were going to end up marrying him at all, or? Oh yeah, kinda, I yeah. did. Yeah. I kind of knew, yeah. Um, okay, so what was like the beginning of your marriage like? Do you remember like, I know, was, was this your the first house you guys moved no, into? No, we were in an apartment at the beginning in Carteret. And I remember uh, we, were, we, were, we were married in October, so we said in Thanksgiving we were gonna, I was going to cook the turkey and we were going to eat home and then go see our parents afterwards. Well, I cooked the turkey, but I left everything inside the turkey, so we had no turkey. <laughs> <laughs> so that was, that, that was... And then I had Patrick very uh, nine months after, so I had a baby right away, and uh, when Patrick was, Patrick was maybe one and a half or two, we moved here. Recipe kind of evolved from what it used to be. Well, I did. I did change it. Okay. I I don't make it real thick like my mother used to. She used to make it thick. I make it a little bit thinner. And, that's and I'm sure I'm sure my meatballs are not the same as hers, even though she gave me the recipe. But I know they're not the same as hers, and. Uh, I don't use the same kind of tomato she used. She used, I don't know what kind she used, but I use what we, what we get in the, in the shop. Right. I don't think my mother bought tomatoes in the shop right. I think she must have gone to an Italian store or butcher or someplace to get them. Because huh. she used to get her meat and everything at the butcher, so I don't know. Check it. Check it, check it, check it. Yes. Oh, I can't see. No, it's, a cool, it's not even, yeah, it's not even halfway full. Every time I do it, it goes over the top. I know, I guess. Why is it? No, yours does too. You put too much. No, it's just got to be too That's enough. It takes a little time. You can ask your mother. It takes a little time to 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 uh, get that sauce just just the way you want it. Mm. You know, you make a lot of mistakes. Yeah, sure. Like right now, right now, my uh, meatballs might be burning. <laughs> no, just let's see what they look like. <laughs> look at them. I think I made them. See, talking about is there any difference in them? No, they're not ready. 
Is there any difference in them? You see what I mean? They came too big and, and <laughs> you know? Yeah. So see, it's been how many years? 58 years I've been married. Yeah. And I started making that when we got married. Mm. And I still made, didn't make them right. It's after 58 years, so. I guess it, it takes time. Mm-hmm. You always can goof off, John. You always can screw something up. <laughs> Today is Saturday, right? Yeah. So he has to get a refill on the 15th. So today is what date, John? The 7th. 7th? Yeah. 8th, 9th, 10th, 13th, 14th, 15th. See, he didn't take son of a bitch. <laughs> Did you take the phone with him? Do you, do you enjoy like making it or is it something that you find? Yeah, I don't mind making yeah. it. I don't mind making it. So I know it takes a long time, so you kind of have yeah. to plan out. The preparation isn't bad, you know, to, to get everything ready and make your meatballs and everything. Once you're done with that, with your meatballs, you know, you can, uh, you just have to wait until it's done a few hours. That's all. Yeah. The, the, the beginning of it is, you know, get your tomatoes and this and that and whatever else. But it's not bad to do. I don't mind. 